Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> hello, hello, hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Marta here. How are you my friends? I hope you are having a good day and I believe you are slowly getting ready for Christmas and if so, maybe you will find this inspiration helpful. If you are short in some ideas for card making, I this video could be a perfect one for you. I really enjoyed it making this, uh, I really loved it. Have a look how pretty uh, that is. Easy, inexpensive and you can also uh, use your imagination, ha have a little bit of downtown, downtown yeah, downtime, <laughs> uh, relaxing a little bit, uh, contemplating, painting and crafting together. I hope you will stay and join me and get your paints out and if you don't have paints but wish to have them under your Christmas tree as a gift, don't forget to use uh, this opportunity because it's a black weekend, Black Friday, um, Cyber Monday, whichever to use and links for the paints and all the beautiful art supplies are below my video so check it out Artiza has up to 60% off but anyway let me go and show you how I made this card because it is very special and I have to say I had this vision at least uh, last year but I just didn't have enough time to do it so I had to squeeze this video for uh, this year I hope you will enjoy it uh, so yes let's paint together so where do we begin? I have some watercolor paper and I'm gonna be making some circles actually. Just a plastic circle. Um, I'm gonna be tracing it around to create my bubbles. Very easy exercise. <laughs> Nothing complicated. So that's one bubble. Then you can maybe decide for, mm, I would like the bubble, another bubble here. So I'm going around again with my pencil, but I was thinking, hmm, I would like this bubble to maybe have this sort of shape. Nice, I like that. Now here I'm thinking, hmm, it would be nice to have another one. So we start off from a circle but we will be building kind of around the edge and a little bit extra to make sure that it's evenish. Mm -hmm. And same for here, we could just make it a little bit more, make it a little less roundy. More like an oval, something like that. I hope you can see that. And then what about a little bit of a smaller thing? So I have this, uh, this little circle here that could, I think could look nice really if we place it there. And for the balance, how about here? I think so, could be here. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now, we could of course, uh, we will do design, but before we do anything, what we could do is we can have a little bit of play here and create the, create the hanging part. Free-handed, guys. Free-handed. Don't be afraid. Mm -hmm. And same for here. There we go. And same for here. There we go. I like that. Now, what about some designs? We should do some designs. Uh, we could go here halfway, maybe. We could have maybe a little bit of a roundy design here. I like that. I like that. Now, how about... Mm, I think I'm gonna grab my 
my my my my my my rubber I found it so I'm gonna just clean this part off so we will have a better view better look for what we're aiming here and same for here hmm. there we go how is that I love it I like it actually now another thing we could do is we could maybe go here for mm, maybe line here and how about making a line here and we could do design like the what you call them um, uh, diamonds freehanded again now today's video it's more about being precise than usually because it, you know when you have free uh, when you have hand painted beautiful bubbles it's perfect if they are actually uh, freehand painted so that's the beauty of them I think I guess and we could have a little bit of a triangle I hope if my head I hope my head is not in the camera too much something like that um, we could make a different line here as well what about making a circle here maybe about making a star oh, hand drawn star is always the biggest the biggest trouble for me to to be honest that didn't work too well that's okay feel free to fix it guys just redo it and that's it there we go that's fine now we could as well have maybe how about how about if we make a line here and also I I believe you can see that it's night time I have <laughs> pajamas on the night night kind of wear thing around the house because it's late there we go I love that Hannah is asleep, Emily is asleep, Lucas is gone, but he, oh, I just heard him, actually, he's back for a short moment, I think, mm -hmm. no, I'm gonna skip this one, because it's very similar to the big ones, but I really wish to keep it, you know, kind of, I don't know, just, so I'm gonna come up with something else, maybe while we paint or something, I don't know. Um, we could actually have maybe lines even going like that kind of way. Why not? That's interesting. Okay, now it's time to choose our paints and before we choose the paints I'll show you something else. Mm, this is the paper that I'm using. It's fantastic because it's very thick. It's 300 grams. It comes in two pack of two books. Absolutely amazing. It's very good quality, very thick paper, which means it's not going to be curl under your watercolors if you add too much water. I'm cutting it in smaller pieces, no problem. I'm recording this video quickly for you, so you will be able to still use a Black Friday, Saturday and Cyber Monday uh, offers because Arteza actually is having the whole weekend offers up to 60% off you have to check them out the prices are so 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 low and this set that I'm using right now it's the 60 60 Arteza gouache uh, oh, 60 Arteza gouache colors these are my favorites but I have them all here as well you could see them in my previous videos if you're following me um, if you will be using links below the video given by me just so you know those are affiliate links which means that I'm getting a percentage of a sale if you will use those links those are for USA and for UK and this is how us youtubers artists um, that's how we make living by uh, if you're helping purchase your products products for yourself a percentage commission for us so I thank you in advance 
and yesterday's Friday's video uh, you have gone to shop and you shopped and you shopped and thank you so so much so I thought I'm gonna come up with another quick inspiration for you today so you will be able to hear about the promotion in case you didn't watch yesterday's video so that's where the idea for this video came from and also I really really wanted to make this particular um, inspiration bubbles 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 in a proper way as in don't get me wrong I always say to you oh don't be so precise don't be so perfect but today it's all about mm, maybe not perfection but perfecting kind of pro 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 proper properly <laughs> making it really really nice oops I went too far that's okay so I just added lines just to have it done but you know now the colors I'm gonna go for the scheme of colors let me show you that probably these are the colors that I'm gonna be using uh, I sprayed them a little bit and I'll, um, I don't need to spray them actually anymore because they are sprayed already um, some of the colors that I hope to use let me just show it to you a little bit of gray not so typical isn't it then we have this gorgeous bluish gray which I love 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 totally then we have this beautiful it's like this um, pink but it's um it's more like a plummy color like I love it basically <laughs> and what else I was planning to use black for definite white for definite but maybe also a, a bit of um, how about a little bit of this blue I didn't plan of using it but I think it could brighten up everything so I'm gonna have a look if this will match our color combo for today's project so let's see I think it could be just awesome just beautiful oh yes it will brighten up the whole scenery um, I think so oopsie don't move please don't go please don't go okay so that's what we have I think a little bit of black as well will go for it and maybe yellow how about yellow or green green or yellow green yellow I think yellow is gonna win now because it will just give this touch of oh yes I love it okay so that's our color combination for today's project and um, those are gouaches. Gouaches are different than regular watercolors because these are opaque, these are more chalky, these are more like a full coverage. It's like a acrylic and a watercolor joined together. Uh, someone said it that's acrylic and the watercolor is having a baby and that's where the gouache is coming. And I really love this because I think it works perfectly. It's exactly it. So that's what we can call it. It's a mixture of acrylic so they don't dry permanent but like acrylics but they are indeed I need a paper they are indeed um, they are very opaque and very full in color like water like acrylics but not uh, not permanent like watercolor so yes yeah, something really beautiful about those um, so let's just start painting guys I'm gonna start off I may pro speed up process a little bit uh, just in some parts maybe uh, but I really wish you to see it follow it you see it wasn't difficult to actually um, it wasn't difficult to actually oh, I think I have a little bit of a hair there I do I'm, I'm gonna cut it because it will be annoying me for definite it's a teensy teensy hair that it's sticking out there there we go Um, you definitely can follow that guys because it's really simple all you have to do is make a little bit of drawing and then follow up with the color the beauty about the gouaches is that it's like this opaque full coverage I love it love it love it I just I always wanted to try gouaches but I kind of never got um, I just it just didn't happen earlier I don't know how is that possible so now when I had a chance to try Arteza I'm in total love and I can highly recommend them to you Lots of friends of mine are uh, having using Arteza. Plenty gorgeous, amazing, talented artist, watercolor artist is using Arteza. So uh, definitely something to think about. Um, maybe I'm gonna go for this as well here. Okay, I can actually be more maybe spontaneous here and just uh, not even draw all the lines but still try to make some kind of design I think so possibly 
Okay, I like that. We can move on to maybe um, a design here or this one actually. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe our um, diamonds this time. I'm thinking. So I really hope that you're watching my video right now. But you have grabbed your watercolors and you are painting. Emily is still here. She came downstairs saying that her belly is sore. Uh, so yes, daddy is trying to tell her that it's too late to be around. So she made some peppermint tea and hopefully this will give her a little bit of help for her belly. So yes, if you're skipping and not watching full tutorial and not listening to my chitty chitty chats, be sure to check Arteza because they have this awesome offer, Black Friday, Cyber Monday offer, up to 60%, like pre they don't only have watercolors, you know, they have markers, they have even alcohol markers, they have like tons of beautiful things, I'm not done with them yet, I really wish to try more of their products. And I think it's just a fabulous, affordable, um, affordable brand with a really, really great, great product. Honestly, that's that's what I'm thinking. That's what I think. That's how I feel about them. So I should be actually exercising right now because I'm really into exercises, yoga twice a week uh, outside home. That's my me time. But I also do yoga every day by myself. You know. Believe or not, <laughs> I know, maybe hard to believe, but yes, I do that, and and I exercise every day. I'm trying to get fit. I'm trying to go back to feeling better, lose some weight if it's possible, but certainly try to just feel better about myself. You know, try to go back to be fitter, uh, especially that now it's Christmas time coming. We'll be eating. Uh, eating out maybe we be like in general eating because it's Christmas time Emily couldn't you be louder <laughs> everyone can hear you <laughs> so yes uh, that's that's what I do every evening every night and I meant to actually reply emails today literally uh, I have tons of emails to reply messages on Facebook as well that was the plan but then I, when I realized that Arteza has the offer for longer, I thought I have to give it a, a chance for more people to hear about it. Uh, because yes, of course, it's the way I, I, um, I earn my commission. But I truly want you to use the offer. I truly want you to have a chance to buy fabulous product in a great price. There's so many people on a budget, and yeah, that's the, that's the case. You know, that's. That's what I'm thinking, why not to give it the best possibility for you to use it, so... Uh -huh. I like that. I'm ki I kind of left around, if you can see, a little bit white. Uh, that could be just nicer for, um, kind of to keep it, you know, a little bit um, more, what's the word? Um, contrast in between, so I may leave it like that. Uh, I'm just using one color right now, but of course I'll be adding different colors at some point. <laughs> uh, I'm not too sure yet when, but at some point. Mm -hmm. I may need a little bit more of that. Now feel free to skip this, guys. There is this button to skip the video and make it faster. So watch it faster as well for yourself. Feel free to do that. I, d I won't mind. There is this button, I never use it, but I know people do use it sometimes. I'm a chatter, so of course not everyone. Some people want to just be down to action, just go for it, girl, stop talking. <laughs> and I just, uh, I, may, I may fast forward some parts of this video as well in a minute, but I really wish you to see kind of the maybe startup of how I see it, and then it will be easier for me to basically give you uh, a, a quick quicker video kind of thing so there we go 
at least so you will see how I play with one color. Now that not that I'm an expert, not at all, but I'll show you my my previous trial. Dum -da -dum -da -dum. I've started something. I've done it, uh, but I'll show you later. We'll see if I'll make any progress with this one. I've made. I kind of learned a little bit from it, so I decided to to give it a go once more. And I did it off camera. I, I actually regret I didn't record it because it, it came out really nice, you know? So a little pity I haven't pressed play even when I was just playing because press record, even if just playing because um, I can always add music and you can still enjoy the tutorial as it is. But I haven't, so I said, okay, I'm gonna recreate that. I've made some mistakes uh, in the process in the, the other cards, so. Oh, I thought it would be nice to just change it now and as well show you how to do it better. For example, with the star to really try to keep it outside of lines and have more space left. Same for here, around the, around the, um, those, um, what you call them? I keep on forgetting. I know that you're sitting there and it, you know exactly, um, diamonds, I mean, I meant. Mm-hmm. So, oh, I hear that Emily is leaving and Lucas is uh, back for a few minutes, he's, I think, 2 o'clock in the morning, he needs to leave to collect people from Christmas parties are starting now, obviously, so people are out and about having a pint, having a drink, having a laugh with uh, co-workers or friends and all. Okay, step number two. So we're gonna go and choose um, another, co oops, not another color, and I'm gonna go for this blue one first. Um, oh, actually no, do you know what? I'm gonna go for that, yeah, I'm gonna go for this blue to start with, and I'm gonna just, I will sit down, do you mind if I sit down on my chair because I just can't ban bend all the time. So I'm gonna just use my chair right now. And there is, I hope you can see the difference and I hope you can see that how opaque those are and how absolutely fantastic. Now, you don't have to be so precise. I'm just hoping for this precision because I think it will just give this beautiful effect and also uh, I can be sometimes precise, isn't it? Not, you know, don't be too stressed over it. No, 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 not at all. N not, not over precise and don't be nervous. Just a little bit, you know. So I'm leaving more white in between as well. So when, in case the color didn't dry, it's not gonna be joined like. Uh, but it, I think it also will just look nicer, basically. That's what I'm thinking. So let's see what we can do. I think we could start with coloring this one as well. I'm leaving some white space as you can tell and it's just much easier to paint and with watercolors when you just have regular watercolors I get the vibe that you kind of work on a palette aside which with aside from your watercolors which here I'm working directly with the paint because I want the pigment to be strong and like very opaque so a lot of pigment goes into my painting into my brush right now but again there are different I'm sure schools and ways of painting watercolor washes but that's what I'm learning myself oops at this moment that's how I kind of understand it and that's that's what works actually great for me that's what I love I'll see if I can bring the camera even slightly closer to you so I can move this aside here and really be closer if I can only make the sharpness for you guys as m oh, I can't no please don't go oh no my camera is getting worse and worse recently maybe I'm gonna go foul oh maybe like this uh, I feel it's getting worse and worse and this actually bubble looks nearly like <laughs> like a Easter egg isn't it <laughs> that's what actually it reminds me of an Easter egg Okay, so that's what we have right now, guys. That's what we have. Let's see what we can do more. How about adding this way here as well? Okay. 
I'm just checking if you can see, but you are, and I'll just check if it's recording. It is. It is, yes. Of course I could speed it up, but I, I guess I could show it to you a lot without speeding up, isn't it? And we can just spend nice time together. There's so many people that are by themselves, even during Christmas, before Christmas. I hope you're not on your own, and if you are, you can actually talk to someone and just try not to be on your own. Maybe your neighbor, maybe your further family, maybe some friends wouldn't mind giving you, um, spending Christmas with you. I know, easy to say, isn't it? Uh, actually, I didn't tell you, but I will now. Um, we are going away for Christmas to our families. For the first time in 14 years, we will spend Christmas in Poland. Wow! I don't think you can imagine how excited we are. I am probably the most excited from all of us. I'm just so ecstatic and that's why I'm working ahead so much and trying to record as much as I can not to leave you without videos. I cherish you being around my channel so I want you to have enough to enjoy <laughs> while I'm gone. And yes, I cannot wait. There's so much beauty in my country uh, during Christmas and I miss it so much here. And also I just want to see it because I know it's changed so much for, for good, like for great. Uh, I, I'm sure I'm gonna try to record some vlogs for you if you wish to. Would you like to see some Christmas vlogs or is it RT channel and I shouldn't? Let me know. I would love to hear from you if you wish me to record vlogs from Poland how we spend time around Christmas time. Not really, like, you know, not every day and not everything, but maybe you would say, would, maybe you, oops, I'm off camera, would you like to watch it and see things from my homeland, our homeland. Okay, how are we doing? Where are we at now? Let's just move on to different color. How about that blue now? because I think it's so nice and pretty and delicate and all and then and then so that blue 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 it's very bright you can see sorry it's very bright and I think it will just nicely brighten up everything so that's awesome and I think I'm gonna go for that uh, I think so yes I'm gonna just go for this color here mm -hmm. I think so I think it's so beautiful. My poor Lucas is listening his um, news and stuff on the headphones. <laughs> he doesn't mind. No, he doesn't mind. But it was a hard day today, actually, with Hannah. She was, she had a, she was loud. Basically, she she gave us a little bit of a headache in terms of loudness. Whatever was going on with her, but there was a lot of toilet happening, so I believe she could be teething. And yeah, if it happens, that's what happens. But yeah, it, we, the qu I think that's why I kind of enjoy as well today, <laughs> relaxing, doodling, and it's not even doodling, but painting and drawing and just relaxing because it was a long day and it was a very loud and tiring and I got up early for yoga today. So yeah, it was, it's just nice now chat to you silly like this because it's like I'm talking to myself but I, I know that afterwards <laughs> it's like I'm, I am talking to you and I know you need that I need that too so we need each other hugely oh I love it 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 so much and yes so I don't think Lucas minds it he he's resting his own by his own although he's back to work again and I don't even know what time is now. I'll tell you what time is now. Oh, it's midnight actually. <laughs> it's midnight, so it's pretty intense, intensively late. Now I'm gonna leave this coloring. I'm gonna go for this one maybe. And I'm just trying to think for what color to use and all. But I think I'm gonna go for this one here. So yes, uh, that was a day today. I managed to make a journal page for cafe for my Facebook group. Marimis Creative Cafe. I'll show you that journal book 
journal page because it's stunning I absolutely adore it and you loved it as well there's no video on it unfortunately but I promise you I will do something similar or very very nearly identical because you've asked me asking me asking me for it so and it's actually made with uh, those pastels which are just oil pastels and those washes so I'm using washes now to every single project if I can squeeze it in so it's a good buy and I'm not trying to push you to buy not at all but it's if you thinking it's your best option with the prices now and there's I'm not too sure if the coupon code 10% off from me works together today with the Black Friday you may check it out you may get more more maybe better deal because uh, I'm I'm giving you 10% off as well purchase but I'm not too sure honestly I didn't ask if it's working while um, while Black Friday is happening so Black Friday Black Saturday <laughs> Cyber Monday and all of that crack so you you may you may as well check it out but still even without the code the prices are really good so sorry I'm talking about this again I shouldn't I don't want you to feel pressurized in any way like um, but I'm sure that 2020 will be a lot of gouaches <laughs> I think since I, I, I like it so much I, I believe and sometimes you're asking me what is that and then I'm telling you and now it's your chance to buy it cheaper so that's why Jesus Martha say nothing more <laughs> about it okay color gray the dark gray which is absolutely lovely as well let's go for this one first and see where is this taking us maybe oh I love 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 it so it's like um, it's gray but it's very into this greenish I love it I just love th those uh, colors as well those are my most favorite probably from the whole set as well there's few of them uh, all of the pastelish actually colors pastel chalkiness all of them I love to bits am I recording still I am okay I'm definitely better more precise than <laughs> than with this card them there them but we'll see it's not we're not over yet I may still do some kind of mistake when it comes to oops I, I touched too took too near but that's okay I wanted to leave gaps but it's fine um, I'm not I know that it's not easy to it's much easier to do it with the brush like the marker brush so if you don't have watercolors or you don't like using watercolors you certainly can use um, Mm, water brush markers like for this design for this kind of work definitely and you could be more like happier with it and luckier because it's just uh, a different sort of precision with the brush and or just coloring drawing and all so you know if it if it helps okay I know what I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna go for smaller and then go for the yellow around it I guess it could be nice I think so I'm not that off camera okay good mm -hmm. so one more here maybe also gouache this gouaches they have amazing amazing um, amazing amazing what I wanted to say amazing um, white very opaque you can do great splashes with it <laughs> if you're thinking about it I took pink but I'm not too sure why exactly that's okay I may just do this A little bit of line, line work. Mm -hmm. We go back to some other color, which may be this blue. Mm -hmm. Okay, I know what I will do. I'm gonna go for 
this blue here. dry yet that's okay we wait for it to dry oh no I'm gonna go for the yellow now so I need my brush to be really really yellow I uh, know really really clean <laughs> mm -hmm. oh someone is yawning <laughs> um okay I'm not too sure why it stopped recording mm. So something uh, was not recording. <laughs> I don't know why and what, but it wasn't. So I'm gonna add now this yellow, yellowish, uh, yellowish circles, dots. Mm -hmm. I may redo that, so no worries. It is still recording. I don't know why it stopped recording. That's why I'm checking from time to time, you know, because it is stopping. Maybe because it's too long in one go, but it shouldn't. Like my battery is not full. My 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 card memory card is not full either. So I have no idea why is this happening. Um. So yeah. That's why I'm sometimes saying to you. Am I recording? We are recording and we are. Now I'm stressed that I <sighs> that I should be checking. Do you know what guys? I'm gonna be finishing off with the music maybe now and come back to you in a minute when most of it is done. Okay? back to you look at that I think it looks really really nice now my next step will be to use some Arteza uh, smear proof and I have uh, pens and I have fine point and medium point black and the rest are medium point so I'm gonna grab that black one and see oh no that's the blue and see I've used that before but if you wish to have a look at them fantastic which is the smaller this one so I'm gonna use the smaller and I'm thinking to just add little dots little dots to our mm -hmm. I have to say I absolutely love it. The idea for this could be that if you will make one card like this, you could copy it and make more pieces for others because painting everything yourself, it's a lot of 
time to be honest and to be so precise to not make any mistakes uh, you know for now I didn't smudge anything but it's easy to smudge something and just make a little bit of a mess so be very careful about that oh I love it love it love it love it love it let me show you this one so that's what we have similar but different and I'm gonna be adding some black lines as well maybe like here so this is giving us this kind of definition I guess that's what we can say a little bit of definition I love it love it love it love it Mm -hmm. I'm just I'm just trying not to really uh, smudge the black, especially where where the, those big black lines are, uh, black holders are. Mm -hmm. I will still use some white. I hope in a minute. What I did in the, the other bubble, I've used more and I think I will still do it. I used the, the pens, the brush itself, I may take this tiny brush um, to make the, the thicker lines, to make it more contrasting. So let me just go back to it. To you for a final touch <laughs> we need Merry Christmas um, I think I'm gonna go for my most favorite one um, if you're wondering where I got this stamp it's Inca stamp Inca stamp A-I-N-C-A A-N-C-A stamp okay super Actually, no, I'm gonna go for the other one. Now, you can see the difference. This is my learning, <laughs> this is my trial, this is my final look, let's say. I like them both. Uh, this is more precise and finished looking, I'd say. Where this one is, I don't know, I, I think definitely those three could be better. So now I kind of did it better, but then the outlining isn't the best. Ah, 
you know what I'm very happy with it I'm very very happy I think it's gorgeous my advice for you is to go for limited amount of uh, color like what I did here you have all these colors that I've used here here I don't have that uh, blue one um, so I felt that it's a little bit dull and dark so that's why I prefer this one with a bit of touches of, of this bright blue but it's a personal thing and of course you can get a, a, a card maybe not this one do I have any bigger base card let me see okay I have it I have it it wasn't measured really for them but yeah that will do <laughs> I think it looks really really nice so there you go you can add it to your bases and uh, your cards are ready I smudged here a little bit that's okay anyway I really hope you liked it and enjoyed it don't forget to check out his all the links are below use this uh, opportunity to have a discount for Black Friday the whole black weekend thing and Cyber Monday and Sunday and all so whenever you're watching it um, yeah I hope you liked it enjoyed it and found it inspirational I truly love this card honestly I hope you also tried it for yourself because it's a really relaxing really fun really challenging in a way as well to be patient precise to to take your time to really not rush anything and I liked it and enjoyed it I took a break I watched some cart uh, cartoon I wanted to say I watched some TV with Lucas he went to work I've done exercise so I I finished now and I'm gonna I'll see if I will manage to upload it now it's very late in the night but I'm tempted to wait for Lucas so I'll see um, anyway anyhow I, I wish you a beautiful day or night or evening whenever you are watching thank you so much as always if you find it inspirational and wish to share it with your friends it would be amazing if you share it on your social media thank you so much I love you loads but I'm gonna have to go it's late so till the next time happy painting see you soon bye bye bye